Hi, everybody. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Welcome to day two of 31 days of Oscar on Turner Classic Movies. All month, we'll be comparing Oscar-winning and nominated pictures connected by some common bond. Could be their Oscar category or a shared subject matter or theme. Tonight, we start with two movies from the 1960s that each won the Oscar for Best Visual Effects. We begin with a futuristic sci-fi adventure from 20th Century Fox. From 1966, Fantastic Voyage. Set in the far distant future of 1995, it's the story of a group of scientists who have developed a way to shrink to microscopic size. They use this technology to enter the body of a fellow scientist who has suffered a brain injury. They hope to save his life. The Oscar-winning visual effects came from the mind of Art Cruikshank. Cruikshank started his career as a cameraman for Disney before segueing to visual effects, first on television, ultimately in feature films. The effects made the film an Oscar winner, but the cast is notable as well. Fantastic Voyage marked the first starring role for Raquel Welch, who'd just been put under contract to Fox after being spotted in a beauty contest by the wife of the film's producer, Saul David. The cast also includes Stephen Boyd, Edmund O'Brien, and a young James Brolin in one of his earliest roles. From 1966, directed by Richard Fleischer, this is Fantastic Voyage. In addition to winning the Oscar for Best Visual Effects, Fantastic Voyage also won for Best Art Direction. There were also nominations for Best Cinematography, Editing, and Sound Effects. The film eventually became so popular it inspired a novel by Isaac Asimov based on Harry Kleiner's original screenplay. It also set the stage for a new sub-subgenre of sci-fi films about going inside the human body. Films like Inner Space and Osmosis Jones all came from the idea originated by Fantastic Voyage. For several years in Hollywood, there's been talk of a sequel or a remake, most notably a project by director James Cameron, who even had a working script in development. Cameron eventually abandoned the project to focus on a little film called Avatar. Guillermo del Toro, the Oscar-winning director of The Shape of Water from 2017, is the most recent filmmaker to toy with the idea of another fantastic voyage. Up next, the visual effects Oscar winner of 1967, a musical starring Rex Harrison.